Miss Miguel Reyes. I'm postdoctoral researcher at India Energy Institute, also associate lecturer at the University Rey Juan Carlos. And my background is on energy modeling, mainly thermal power plants, and in particular, characterization of turbines. Yeah, well, the role we are doing on NexCSP project is related to the optimization of power cycles to be coupled to the uh, particle receiver concept from NexCSP. Well, I decided to take part in this project because I believe that concentrating solar power will be key for the next future with a high penetration of renewable energy sources because one of the main benefits about concentrating solar power is the fact that you can control the electricity dispatch based on the energy storage and it's a great opportunity to prove that uh, using particles as a storage medium is a clever idea because we can go to very high temperatures. That is something that you cannot achieve with current commercial plants. And instead of that, uh, the high temperature will allow us to move into very high efficient uh, power cycles. The most challenging part is that we are envisioning how concentrating solar power plants will look in future. So we don't have that much uh, components nowadays about this technology for the very high temperature and using particles. So yeah, it's going to be very challenging and related to my field uh, using, for example, combined cycles for external heat addition that would happen in concentrating solar power is something very new and there is not that much expertise outdoors so that's something that we are investigating right now. Yeah, sure, we have the, the luck to belong to a big consortium with many groups and companies leader on this technology so just working together and discussing about all these technical questions is something that, of course, will, will make a very important output. Up to this moment, we have already optimized and designed which should be the working conditions of a combined cycle that will operate at the temperature from the next ESP receiver that is 800 degrees, that is not that high for a combined cycle, but we came to a peculiar and very wide solution that allow us to achieve six points more of efficiency than current commercial power plants for concentrating solar power. Well, uh, I think that we have already gone one step further because we are already proving this technology in a pre-commercial level that is going to be 4 megawatt thermal. That's an interesting size for pre-commercial technology. But obviously the next stage will be just to demonstrate this uh, concept into a commercial size, let's say 10 times bigger, like 50 or 60 megawatts. And that's something that we will need some uh, industrial partners. I think industries are really interested in this because uh, there is one of the, the challenges that we need to overcome that is contribute on the cost reduction of the technology. And one of the ways to go is just to increase the efficiency of the power cycle. And that's something related according to thermodynamics to the temperature. And now here that we can go up to 800 degrees easily with particles, we can move to very high efficient combined cycles and that kind of power cycles. And obviously those companies will be really interesting. So I think they should keep an eye on the output from the project. We still have like one year or so to go. So let's see.